EA Sports. It's in the game. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Barclays Premier League. Today it's Liverpool against Manchester City. What a big day. The league title could be won here today. Stay glued to your screen. This could be dramatic for the home fans. Let's head straight off to Anfield, shall we? Magnificent day on Merseyside. The sun beating down. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there, Alan Smith. Hi there to everybody from both of us. And welcome to this big match today. Well, with the rise of Manchester City, with the money that they've been getting from the, the Middle East, their games against the traditional top sides become more and more important now. And here we have City against Liverpool today. No, that's right. I mean, everybody's having to cut the clock for the financial fair play regulations, and City are aware of that more than most, but they've got a really good side. As have Liverpool, it has to be said. This is the Liverpool side. Simon Mignolet starts in goal. Martin Skirtle starts alongside Daniel Agger in the heart of the defence. In attack, Daniel Sturridge partners up front with Ricky Lambert. Manchester City's lineup today. Joe Hart starts in goal. Vincent Company starts with Martin Dimichelis as the centre backs. David Silva plays today with Sami Nasri looking to provide width. In attack, Sergio Aguero joins up front with Edin Dzeko. Well, this is the day of destiny, Alan, isn't it? The title is there for them. Win the game, win the silverware. That's all you can ask for, isn't it? I mean, what more... Mo Are so good. As it stands, they will be champions. Yeah, they're holding it together. Mm -hmm. the 45 minutes, they'll be fine. Something to talk about at half-time, Alan, that penalty incident. And it's helped the team that are leading at the break. Yeah, there were plenty of people in the crowd supporting the opposing side that didn't feel it was a penalty, but uh, if they look at the replays later, I think they might agree with the ref. So we reach half-time, 2-0 the score, with Liverpool leading. Let's take a look at the highlights from that first half, and then we'll be straight back to your commentary team for the rest of the game. his feet now, Daniel Lager, a good tackle to get it. They have done it, they have won the league title, fantastic. Well, you've got to look at them over the course of the season, Martin, and well worth their title as champions here. take for granted you'll ever win anything again so when you do get a winner's medal as they're getting here and celebrating just drink it in milk the moment it's easy to think that the good times will keep on a rolling but it's not always the case i think these players appreciate that it's been a brilliant occasion all credit to the organizers for the way it's staged it sets it up makes it such a theatre for these football performers to go on. And this team didn't fluff their lines, did they? They certainly didn't, and that's so satisfying. As a professional, you can look back to your big moments, the big occasions, and know that you played your part, you played well. Good team, aren't they? And I think there's only better times ahead for this group of players.
move right, we can dance all night, no money in the Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of this friendly. Today it's Barcelona against Chelsea. Let's head straight off to Anfield, shall we? Magnificent day on Merseyside, the sun beating down. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there everyone, Martin Tyler here with me today. I'm delighted to welcome Alan Smith. Oh, hi there Martin, absolutely delighted to be here. I have to give uh, Roman Abramovich a pat on the back for getting Chelsea to be mentioned in the same uh, paragraph, playing the same type of fixture as a, a club against a, a team like Barcelona. And they've come pretty much in the last 10 years to this elite level, haven't they? Yeah, when you think of where they came from in the 70s, 80s, 90s, uh, it's been an amazing success story. Obviously cost a few quid. Barcelona's line-up here. Marc-Andre Testegen starts in goal. Javier Mascherano plays with Jared Piquet in central defence. Xavi starts with Iniesta in the middle. Lionel Messi is the main striker today. Here's the Chelsea lineup. Hedicek starts in goal. John Terry plays with Gary Cahill in central defence. Fabregas plays with Nemanja Matic in central midfield. Diego Costa is the lone striker today. Just thinking of Chelsea in that 2013-14 season when uh, Mourinho came back, uh, they did the double over the champions, uh, Manchester City, double over the team that was second, Liverpool, galling only to finish third. Well, yeah, I think yeah that would be the case, and that's an example of Jose Mourinho setting up his side perfectly to do the job against specific opponents, and there's not many better. That uh, it's against the bottom half teams that they had some problems, didn't they? So that's in an area they need to address. Be an interesting time for Barcelona now, won't it? Messi signed a new long-term contract, new manager, to see whether they can recreate what they've done before, whether they'll have to go a different route to try and get there. Well, maybe so. Different managers have different methods. And uh... Here, as the half-time whistle goes, as we look back on the first half, that early goal looked crucial. It did. And, uh, haven't really looked back since getting it. They haven't relaxed, and uh, we've looked the better side of it. So we reach half-time, 1-0 the score, with Barcelona leading. Let's take a look at the highlights from that first half, and then we'll get straight back to the commentators for the rest of the contest. counter-attack really working and the defenders have got possession now and they've snuffed it out well the referee has brought a halt 
to it, that's full time. No extravagant celebrations at the end, you wouldn't expect that after a friendly, but they've enjoyed their workout and they, they played pretty well. They did play well, they knocked the ball about with uh, a lot of uh, confidence, I'd say, and they look like a team that uh, know each other. So it's full time with a final score 2-0. I'll leave you with the full match highlights. And until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling.